What's up guys, it's your Motivational Gamer and welcome to a ARK Primitive Plus video. In this video we are actually in the map Valhalla, but uh, of course all the Ingrams to Primitive Plus stay the same. Uh, this is my humble home that I'm slowly steadily put together. As you guys see we got a grill here, we got some stuff going on, but that's not what we're going to talk about today. Today there, you know, we're going to talk about some of the Ingrams in Primitive Plus. Um, there are a lot of Ingrams uh, going on. Specifically, two of those happen to be the longbow and the crossbow. The crossbow, as you guys know, for those of you guys who have played Ark before, is pretty common and everybody uses the crossbow, essentially, because it's pretty much OP. Now, there's a new Ingram that's going to surface itself called the longbow, which I'll show you guys here in a second here. We'll go to the Ingram points. The longbow becomes available at level 40. Okay, hold on. That's the, uh, that's the regular bow. I don't care about that one. Longbow, 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 longbow. Where you at? Okay, so yeah, so longbow for 25 Ingram points comes available to you at level 40. Now the question a lot of you probably are having or will have when you guys start playing on Primitive Plus when it launches uh, on July 28th is, should you waste the Ingram points on it not uh, when it comes down to being strategic or strategically using your points? And the answer to that question is maybe. Okay, and what I mean by maybe is, in terms of pure damage, um, the crossbow is king. Okay, so it's still in 95 damage, which equates to about 19 damage per second. So um, what that means to you is, the higher the damage, the easier it's going to be for you to tame things. Because when you tame uh, specific, you know, dinos or whatever. Um, the torpor damage is based off the amount of damage that that particular weapon deals. So that torpor will stack over time. Whereas if you just use the longbow here for the 25 ring points that you get at level 40, although the bow looks pretty cool, it's got, it looks like it's got a little sight built in, it looks, you know, real primitive. And, you know, it just doesn't deal uh, the damage that you need it to deal. So 40 damage is less, which equates to about 11 damage per second. So the problem with that is with less damage, obviously it's going to cost you more arrows to be effective. Um, and more arrows obviously means more time trying to get something down. And as you guys know in ARC, that means that you probably are risking imminent death or danger the longer you take to get a particular dino down. So with that being said, guys, uh, the crossbow is still going to remain king in this battle. So the question is whether or not you're going to get that Ingram. Now that is entirely up to you. If you just want it for, you know, just uh, I got to have it all just because it's in the Primitive Plus mod and that's an Ingram that you just want to have, then by all means do it. That's the reason why I did it. I had a feeling it wasn't going to be as good as the crossbow, but, you know, out of sheer hope, <laughs> and a little bit of wishing I was I was loving to just run through the battlefield with my bow sniping people but eh, guess not so unfortunately um, like I said guys unless you just want the Ingram it is going to be a waste so those Ingram points those 25 Ingram points we could be better spent on other technology to help you move forward in um, primitive plus progression so make sure you guys keep that in mind as you guys move forward. So that's all I wanted to cover today, guys. I just wanted to talk about the subtle differences between the longbow and the crossbow and help you guys make a more efficient decision as to which one you guys are going to spend your Ingram points on. So thank you guys so much for tuning in to yet again another video by The Motivational Gamer, and we will see you guys next time. Peace.